inspires me the most as a designer is the connection between people and design because I'm seeing it firsthand how design is impacting and influencing the people here. Thrive is based in Helena and it is a design nonprofit. And I was really interested in the work that they were doing in the Delta and I wanted to see how our students could both support them and learn from them. And that the first opportunity was to develop a summer internship. These are just a little bit more powerful in terms of having some of the local imagery. Reagan has been working on a poster series for a bank that wants to redefine themselves in the community. This part right here is going to be a different color. We have design programs that serve youth. They work with our designers on graphic design projects. We're working on a mural and this one girl, she's like, I love this because every time I drive by, I'm going to look at that and think, wow, I did that and I am making Helena more beautiful, which was just amazing to hear. And that's exactly what I think that Thrive wants here. They are demonstrating to a lot of the youth in that area that a life in art and design is possible, that it's financially stable, and you can be very successful. The University of Arkansas is the first one that has actively and proactively come to us making that finish line of a career ready student. What I've seen with these students is not only does it give their careers a really great boost, so it really helps round out your portfolio. Maybe more importantly, if we're looking at lifelong learners and designers, it really demonstrates the power of design to work with communities. The School of Art has really prepared me for this through all the classes that I've taken and just with the projects that we've done, I've used so much of what I've learned in my class is here. And I want to use design to change things and help. So they've definitely pushed me and helped me grow as a designer and just as a person.